Hi, I'm Lara Santini and this is taste number five umami paste and it's a little bit of magic and I'm going to show you my five favorite things to do with this tube in five minutes. Firstly, we're going to start with a taste number five vinaigrette, which is very, very simple. I've got a squeeze of taste number five umami paste in here. I'm going to add a good glug of olive oil and a squeeze of lemon. You don't need to add any salt because it's already packed with umami. Good grinding of black pepper. And I'm going to whisk it all up. This is the quickest, most delicious vinaigrette and it's about to become your favorite vinaigrette. I've got some purple sprouting broccoli here and I am going to dress this with my taste number five umami paste vinaigrette and I'm going to top that with some crumbled feta cheese. And for extra umami, I'm gonna put some toasted walnuts. There you go. That's your new favorite salad dressing. Taste number five, good glug of olive oil, and a little squeeze of lemon. Delicious. Next up is the quickest pasta sauce in the world. This is taste number five umami paste, and we're gonna make a five second supper before you can even say the word supper. I've got three cups of chopped cherry tomatoes here. I've got taste number five umami paste. I'm gonna add a generous squeeze of that. This is a raw pasta sauce. All you need to cook is the pasta. So we've got our squeeze of taste number five umami paste. We've got two cloves of garlic cut in half because you don't wanna be tasting that garlic. We've got our pasta cooking here. We've got a good glug of olive oil. Got some grated lemon zest if you like. We're going to put in some torn basil. So this is really the easiest pasta you can make. It's just chopped cherry tomatoes, olive oil, taste number five, a clove of garlic cut in half. This is a raw pasta sauce and the flavors unlock when the hot pasta hits that sauce. I'm going to give it a good stir now. And as I'm tossing it, I can smell the wonderful aromatics. I can smell that taste number five umami. I can smell the lemon zest. I can smell the basil. It's fantastic. I'm gonna add some good grinding of black pepper. And I've got some torn rocket here. And that's it. The quickest pasta sauce ever. That's taste number five umami paste, fresh tomatoes and rocket. Now, I'm going to show you my favorite thing to do with taste number five, and that is steak with taste number five umami paste and a splash of soy sauce and a splash of mirin. It is beyond delicious. So I've got a ribeye steak here that I've already spread on both sides with taste number five and drizzled with a little bit of olive oil. It's now at room temperature and I'm going to put it into a hot pan. And I'm going to cook it to my taste, which is medium rare. The beauty about taste number five umami paste is that it's a seasoning and it also makes a fantastic sauce all at the same time. So we've got our steak in the pan. I'm going to splash that with a little bit of soy sauce. I'm going to splash that with a splash of mirin. And I'm just going to turn it one more time until it's cooked just how I like it. Delicious. Now we're gonna splash these fantastic pan juices with a little bit more mirin, a little bit more soy sauce. We're gonna add another squeeze of taste number five and a good knob of butter. And watch what happens. You are gonna get an umami packed, fantastically rich and glossy sauce to pour over your steak. Guaranteed deliciousness on a plate. Next up is a recipe that I call slap, roll, wrap and splash. And it's as quick as it sounds. We're gonna slap a bit of taste number five umami paste on this chicken breast. And then we are going to roll it in some grated Parmesan cheese that I've chopped some sage through. Then we are going to wrap it in some prosciutto. I'm 
we're going to tuck a little piece of uh, sage into bed with it like that. And we're going to tuck it up like that. And then we're going to splash it with a little bit of olive oil. And we're going to put it in the oven, 180 degrees for about 20 minutes until it's cooked through, depending on the size of your breast. During the cooking, you're going to splash it with a bit of wine and it's going to make the most unbelievably delicious gravy. That is slap, roll, wrap and splash. And you've got that in five minutes with taste number five, umami paste. Next up is a taste number five, umami paste fish parcel. I've got a fish fillet here. I'm choosing cod today. I've spread it with a little bit of taste number five umami paste. I'm going to sprinkle a couple of capers, a couple of chopped cherry tomatoes, and a few pieces of red onion, three black olives, a little squeeze of lemon. I'm not going to use any salt because it's already highly seasoned with the umami paste. Good grinding of black pepper and a sprig of dill. And finally, I'm going to drizzle it with a little glug of olive oil and I'm going to wrap it up and I'm going to cook it in a hot oven at 180 degrees for about 10 to 15 minutes. And this is brilliant for dinner parties. You can prepare it in advance, pop all your parcels in the oven and every single guest gets a surprise. That's taste number five, umami paste, fish parcel. Every time I touch that track, it turns into gold.